Hello friends, welcome to ACAD Tutorials. I'm Ankit Kamtekar and in this video, we have created a classic workspace in latest version of AutoCAD 2019. Just run your software, AutoCAD 2019. Few seconds wait or launch your software. I have a trial version so I click run now click on start drawing before starting this I will inform you I already upload video about create a classic workspace in AutoCAD 2018 version so you can get link from description box of this video now let's start to create a classic workspace First you need to see here your workspace list from here, status bar, graphic annotation, 3D basis and 3D modeling, only 3 workspace by default in AutoCAD 2019. And also you can get the workspace option from quick access toolbar and see your currently working workspace and list of this workspace. So now create a own workspace as AutoCAD Classic. So you first need to close this ribbon so you type command ribbon and here is a ribbon close so when I click your ribbon is hide this is the ribbon also you can hide the ribbon from here just right click on blank space and click on close so your ribbon has been closed now see here the tab of files if you don't want this tab of files so go to option in the display tab you got a option here display file tabs you can uncheck this box apply and see your file tabs in hide but i want these file tabs so i check in and ok now file tabs is back to visible now second is menu bar you can get menu bar from access toolbar drop down arrow here is show menu bar just click on your menu bar is visible also you can visible menu bar from command type of menu bar and see here default value is 0 means your menu bar is hide when you change this value to 1 and press enter your menu bar is visible you see the menu bar is visible here fixed position now we are load toolbars go to menu bar here tool tab just toolbars autocad and you got your list of all toolbars of autocad you can select anyone to visible your toolbar in your user interface i select modify and see your modify toolbar are visible in your in user interface also you can import this toolbar from command just type dash toolbar press enter and type the toolbar name here simply i type the draw toolbar name the draw press enter and click on show is by default enter now see your toolbar draw toolbar are visible here also you can import toolbars just right click on any one toolbar and got a list and import any one toolbar from your list just right click and import which you want toolbar i want more toolbar for classic workspace just click on drop down arrow to check out full list is standard toolbar here is standard toolbar also i want more toolbars for bit you can set your fixed positions of toolbars just select and drag if you don't want any toolbars so click on exit from here and exit your toolbar simply you can load more toolbars just right click any one toolbar and get a list and select 
That's a symbol. This is a basic toolbar to AutoCAD Classic. Just select and drag where you want your selected toolbar. That's it. Finally, you are complete setup for toolbars. So you need to create a save as workspace. So just click on this settings arrow of workspace in status bar and click on save current as. Now you type your name in workspace. This is a list of default workspace. Just type your workspace name as you like. I type my classic 2019. That's it and click on save. Now see your current workspace 2019 is appear and added in list. After create workspace, you add one or more toolbar in your workspace or you can change the position of any one toolbar in your workspace then you need upgrade your workspace because when you back into your workspace so you got selected toolbars on fixed position when you set it finally in your workspace so finally after this setup so you need going out this arrow go to save as current select the you are creating classic workspace save as and autocad asks about replace it just click on replace now your workspace is upgraded then after some time you send change in your toolbar positions that's why i drag this toolbar here and some toolbars are exist from my workspace so i must need to replace workspace to upgrade now just select save and replace it that's it when you back into your autocad workspace so you got this workspace are fixed positions toolbars on user interface that's it i hope you understand this video just click on like button share with your friends don't forget to subscribe my channel and thanks again for watching